What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here and today I am going to show you how to rebuild your database on your PlayStation 5 as well as clearing your cache. So let's get right into this. This is a 2024 tutorial. I'm going to show you what to do and how to do this. Straightforward, very easy and quick to do. So what you need to do is make sure your PlayStation 5 console is completely turned off as you see in mine is and we're going to hold on to the power button until we hear two beeps. Basically we're going to try to enter into safe mode, hence why you need to wait until you hear two beeps. Boom, second beep is heard. Now next thing, make sure you have a USB cable connected to your console and a C cable connected to your controller itself because otherwise you won't be able to do anything in here. We're basically gonna press this button to get to, to be able to use this. So let's just press it. All right, well controller, all right. All right, gotta plug it back in. Sometimes it does act out and it does not fully connect. So keep that in mind. Let me see. All right, uh, like I said, sometimes it starts bugging out. So always kind of like unplug it and plug it back in. Trust me, a lot of people usually ask me what happens. Trust me, the console is weird. Like Xbox, you don't need to do this. It's Bluetooth. For some reason, for PlayStation 4 and 5, you need to have a cable connected. <laughs> Anyways, once you're in here, we're going to option number six, where it says clear cache and rebuild database. You want to basically do this in two folds. One is you just go to option one, which is going to clear the system software cache. And the second one is going to be to rebuild the database itself. You're gonna to have to do this in two fold. Once you do the first one, it's going to restart your console. So you're gonna to have to turn it off to turn it back on to do what you need to do. The second one, same thing. You're gonna basically turn it back off, go back into safe mode and then rebuild the database the second time. Uh, there's no particular order, just go with option one clear system software cache first, then rebuild database. Uh, you don't need to do rebuild database first and then clear system software cache. You don't have to go in that particular order. Uh, I always go one and then two. So that's basically it. That's literally all you need to do once you do that. This is gonna help speed up your PlayStation 5, get rid of possible issues and errors you may be facing, game crashes, all that other bad stuff that was possibly happening. This helps fix those issues. So yeah, that's basically it. If you guys still have any comments, questions, let me know in the comment section. One more than help you guys out. If you guys are like this video, please smash that like button on the side. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Other than that, I'm going to be out. Peace.